we're going to look at how pH levels are measured in different levels of acids and bases. So remind me what an acid is. It's a, a lot of hydrogen plus ions. What makes something a base? Another way that Summit distinguishes itself from other schools is by giving children learning through experience. They have a voice in what happens in the classroom. They're not passive students who are sitting behind a desk listening to a lecture, passively taking notes. They're active and they're actively participating, asking questions, creating their own experiences. I'm going to give you these wells. Solution one is borax. It's going to go on the top left well. Then next to it, milk, and you're just going to go right in order so you know what it is. Soda, baking soda, toothpaste. It's right here. By the color they turn when we put the litmus paper in, that determines whether they are a base or acid. And if it turns blue, it's a base, and if it turns red, it's an acid. These children truly don't see learning as something within a book or on a blackboard. Learning in life to them is this vast experience in whatever interests them, whatever they're passionate about, and whatever drives them is where the learning goes. Oh, that's, that's a base. base. Mm -hmm. My favorite part about science class is that we get to do hands-on experiments. 